Hey YouTube, it's Erin and I am the Handbag Housewife and I'm back again with another video. Today's video is going to be a huge vlog sale. If you hadn't already seen my Instagram page or my YouTube community page, I have posted as of yesterday multiple items and I think two of them have sold. One is payment pending. I thought I would come online here and do a video and show you each of the items that I have left and let you know the prices. First, I decided to sell my Coach Soft Tabby Hobo Bag in the Canyon Multicolor. I wore this bag once or twice. It is still in excellent condition. I do not see much wear to speak of. The strap on this bag is a hinge and does not come off the short strap. And it has a cool little detail here, a C. I do have the hang tag for it, but I find that it gets in the way if I use the crossbody strap along with it. And when I did use this bag, I did use it with the crossbody strap. I'm gonna go ahead and try it on and just show you what it looks like. I have the crossbody strap set on the shortest setting. So here is the bag on me. Of course, you can find the measurements online. This is the soft tabby hobo. If I wear it like this on my shoulder, I just let the strap dangle like that. And I think it looks nice. It's very comfortable under the arm. I do have the bag stuffed right now. I do not use an insert with it. You can, you can see how clean it is inside. All of these bags are almost new. There's one that has a few little scratches that I found on the hardware, but pretty impeccable condition on really all my bags. And so I usually just post one picture on my listings, but I'm certainly happy to provide more. This one is $195. I think the retail on it's either $450 or $495. So if you're interested, let me know. That's shipped within the United States. I did post three colors of my Tory Burch small Willow bags. I think I paid a little over $350 for this one, and I'm selling all three of them for $215 each shipped within the United States. I do not see any wear to speak of. The blue one has already been claimed and the wonderful subscriber who is buying it is paying tonight. So payment is pending on that one. This is the small size. It's about nine and a half inches wide. It fits comfortably on the shoulder or crossbody. And again, I have it in the, I think it's new cream color and also in the toasted pecan. These bags do not come with dust bags because they are from the outlet. And when you look inside of them, they are wide open. I think I maybe have used this one possibly one time. And then the new cream one, I think I used it probably four or five times. The hardware is like a tumbled hardware on both of them. The new cream hardware is silver. And so, it doesn't really show scratches because that's sort of in the nature of the hardware to have a slightly tumbled look or scratched look. It's just sort of almost like frosted hardware instead of shiny, shiny hardware. The reason I'm selling the Soft Tabby Hobo is I just don't carry bags this size very often. And I feel like my Longchamp totes and my Marc Jacobs Cement Mini the Tote Bag both will serve the same function as this bag. And so that's why I decided to let it go. As far as these Willow bags, I love the feeling of the glazed goat skin on them, but I have so many chain flat bags by Gucci and by Saint Laurent and by Tory Burch Retail that I just feel like I have too many. And the one thing about this bag that bothers me is I think that this right here is probably bonded leather or polyurethane. Other than that, I think these are amazing bags and they retail for $5.48 and I'm selling them for $2.15 each. Next, I have the Aspinall of London A camera bag. This bag I got from my friend Amy and it was part of a trade. She thought I should just see what the Aspinall of London leather was like. It wasn't necessarily that it was something that I said I wanted to buy. I did use it one time and the hardware does have some very faint scratches there and on the D-rings as well. I attached a chain to it for myself 
to look pretty. I'm not sure if that's how the hardware got tiny little scratches on it or not. I believe these retail for around $400 and I'm selling this one for $185 shipped. It has an adjustable and a detachable strap. These pegs are super easy to open. Some of the easiest I've ever felt out of the hole and peg type system. I think I have this set on the longest setting and you can see it is a long length on me. I'm 5'8 and usually about a size medium. It has a cute little pocket on the back and the inside is a woven sort of lining and it has one pocket on that side. The last two bags are gonna be a shocker for you that I'm selling them. And I just wanna show you first, this is the one that I'm keeping. This is a Marley 20 and I love the K-Facet Coach collaboration. And this bag, I think it's gonna probably be a forever bag for me. I just love the artwork. I love the textures. I really just love the whole bag. So this is the one I'm keeping. But like I said in some other videos, I'm trying to reduce the number of duplicates that I have of my bags. And so I'm going to go ahead and sell the Beechwood Multi Marley 20. It comes with a gorgeous adjustable crossbody strap and it's $4.99. If you want the charm as well, it's $5.15. These charms will sell for over $100, so this is a really good deal. On eBay, this bag's currently listed for $7.99. It is in brand new condition, but mine is definitely in excellent condition. And I'm just gonna do kind of a close-up for you just to show you that. It's not perfect, but most of these are not perfect. I don't see any corner wear. There was a couple of tiny little specs on it at one time i think it was maybe over here right there there's a tiny little speck and i think there's one right there they're really really little i think it's just inevitable sometimes with these lighter color bags that there's little bits that do not get the dye quite as well i've had that issue with chalk and ivory bags brand new from coach but this bag is in stunning condition here is the interior. It's a suede interior, so it is a full leather bag. And what can I say? She is just gorgeous. And if she doesn't sell, then I will keep her. The last one on the list is the same price. This is the Saddle Multi Marley 20. And I have a charm on it as well. It's $4.99 without the charm. It's $5.15 with the charm. These charms retailed, I think, for $95. I did remove the bottom flower, I think, on it. I think it was the bottom flower. I altered the charm so that it would not fall below the end of the bag. I'm not going to sell the charms if I don't sell the bag. So if you don't want the charm for the extra $15, then I am going to sell it separately, but I won't sell it until the bag has sold. As you can see, the inside looks fantastic. And again, this one is $4.99 shipped within the United States. And if you want the charm, it's $5.15. So that is all she wrote. So I have the Willas, I have the Soft Tabby Hobo, I have the Aspinall of London, and I have the Marley 20 bags. And I would just say that these are just not bags that I've been using. And other than the Aspinall of London being a little bit too small for me and the Soft Tabby Hobo being a little bit too big for me, the Willa bags really there's almost nothing I can say that I don't like about them except for possibly that the inside flap is not leather. The outside is a wonderful glazed goat skin and I've always loved that about it. Tory Burch, they were even using this polyurethane type leather in their Eleanor bags which is one of their retail bags at one point. They had it on their website so I don't think it has anything to do with outlet versus retail, but that would be the only niggle I would have with that particular style. And the Marley 20s, I'm just not reaching for them. I am using kind of different styles of bags and I'm not reaching for that style. And so I would say that is a synopsis of how I feel about these bags and why I'm letting them go. So if you are interested in any, reach out to me. I will put my contact info down in the description box and I look forward to speaking with you. I do accept payment through Zelle, Cash App, PayPal, friends and family, and Venmo, friends and family. And I will provide tracking and ship it either today or tomorrow if you buy today or tomorrow. And 
I think that's it. So if you like this video, please give me a big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, what are you waiting for? Do it and ring the notification bell so that you are notified of future exciting content such as this. Also, go find me on Instagram. The name there's the same. It's the at symbol, then the handbag housewife, all lowercase. You can DM me there or you can email me at the handbag housewife at gmail.com. If I don't hear from you, I will see you again real soon. Take care and have a fabulous day. Bye.